Hi, today we are going to discuss about blue prism surface automation. Whenever we have the optical character recognition or image recognition or else the thin client kind of things, we want to automate, then we can go with the surface automation. Usually we have thin and thick client. In thin client is used for the to describe an application that does not run on the local machine and used in a client and server architecture within the client. Blue Prism cannot use its normal integration technique because the target application is virtual and there is very little spy mode like Win32 and AA, it is, these are all able to detect. So the spy modes we have browser mode, uh, HTML mode or AA mode or Win32 mode. So different spy modes like that but the thing is when we go for that spy modes we will not recognize or we will miss out lot of the elements whenever we capture with the application so that is that the why we are going with the uh, surface automation within the thin client in when we go for surface automation thin client we have to talk about regions the regions is nothing that is the region mode within the surface automation. This is a simply rectangular area whenever we capture with the application modeler studio. It will direct to the user modeler. This is the simple rectangular area within the modeler. When spying in a thin client application using Win32 or AA will yield few distinct elements from to build an application model. In absence of available elements interfacing, we will need regions. In, when we go with the regions, region is a this is the identification tool mode yeah usually the alt key we can switch the spy modes region uh, some other modes when we want to select the items we have to go with the control left click the thing is when using surface automation how does the interaction with an application work within a citrix environment? When using surface automation, what are the various ways we can integrate with the citrix environment? When we go with the citrix environment, you have When you want to start inside the Citrix environment in surface automation, you have to verify font smoothing must be switched off. That is the one important thing. The second thing is, if spying using a browser application, it must be the Internet Explorer 8 or earlier. Otherwise, you can't spy into the surface automation technique within the within the smart surface automation thank you guys we will see some more clarity on on my next video thanks